हेलो वेलकम अगेन टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल वकार एकेडमी टुडे वी लर्न अबाउट द बेसिक कंसेप्ट ऑफ डिफरेंट शेप्स हो हो टू फाइंड एरिया ऑफ दिस शेप्स तो स्टार्ट हेयर इज अ रेक्टेंगल फर्स्ट आई टेल यू व्हाट इज अ पैरामीटर पैरामीटर इज द आउटर लेंथ ऑफ अ रेक्टेंगल सो पैरामीटर ऑफ दिस type of shape mean rectangle rectangle is a shape in which opposite sides are equal in length so area uh, so uh, so parameter of this shape who can write like this uh, so sorry parameter of rectangle is equal to parameter is the outer length of a of any shape so uh, sum of outer length is l plus l mean here length b b mean breadth plus again l plus again b mean breadth so l and l 2l b and b 2b if you take common 2 then l plus b is the parameter of rectangle so if uh, the length and width are given to you then you can easily find the parameter by using this if i say you l is equal to 2 cm and b is equal to breadth is equal to 4 cm then find the area of uh, then find the parameter of this rectangle then you put the value here 2 into length length 2 cm uh, so plus it's b breadth 4 cm so 2 into 4 and 2 6 cm so answer will be a 12 cm so uh, length is measured in cm km decimeter and so on and area will be in cm square so you can easily find the parameter of the rectangle by using this if i say find the area of this type of rectangle then area is equal to area of rectangle is equal to l cross b mean length multiply breadth so if put the value of length 2 here multiply breadth 4 here then your area will be a 2 time 4 is equal to 8 cm square so next diagram i uh, make here like a uh, rectangle but we, here we find the area of triangle what is triangle triangle is the closed shape in uh, three uh, vertices mean if uh, uh, you look here this type if you divide if you divide the rectangle into two parts i divide this is a rectangle i divide the rectangle into two parts then this part is a triangle d c b or d a b so you find the area of this triangle how you find the area of triangle basically rectangle if you divide the rectangle into two parts then the total uh, then the area of rectangle is equal to half of the rectangle so area of rectangle so area of triangle is equal to half of area of rectangle you look here area of rectangle is equal to length multiply breadth so here a, uh, so here area of uh, triangle is the half of the rectangle so 1 by 2 and area of rectangle area of rectangle if you take here l and you take this one is b so l cross b mean l here in triangle l is represented by base and this one is represented by perpendicular or altitudes so area of triangle is equal to 1 by 2 base cross its perpendicular value if i say base is equal to 2 cm and perpendicular or altitude is equal to 4 cm then what will be the area of triangle so area of triangle will be 
is equal to 1 by 2 multiply put the value of base so 2 centimeter multiply a, a length of the sides of mean perpendicular 4 centimeter you can drop this one and this one so your area will be a 4 centimeter square because centimeter and centimeter will be a centimeter square so next is area of parallelogram parallelogram is like a, a shape as a rectangle but its two sides are will be a in curve type like this so area of parallelogram is equal to parallelogram is equal to same as the area of rectangle so you can write b multiply h b mean here base and h mean height if you the if some values are given mean base is given and altitudes are given then you put the value of base and altitude here then you can easily find the area of a parallelogram the last diagram is trapezium okay look this shape is called trapezium in trapezium the four sides are not, not equal in length so how you find the area of trapezium basically you divide this trapezium this type of shape into two rectangles i take this line it's divide this line divides the total uh, shape of this into two two uh, two triangle first triangle is this one and second triangle is this one you can find the area of triangle we have learned the area of triangle how to find the area of triangle like this first you find the area of this triangle so i write here area of trapezium area of trapezium is equal to what will be equal to total area of these two triangles will be the area of trapezium so first i write here the area of triangle this triangle i find the area of triangle uh, uh, this triangle if i write here a b c and d so first find first find area of triangle a b c so, so area of triangle a b c equal 1 by 2 base multiply its height so look here area of triangle is equal to base multi multiply perpendicular perpendicular mean its height so next find the area of this triangle so area of triangle b c and d second triangle is b c d so 1 by 2 base multiply height so uh, here i write the base this one is base and this one uh, this one is base and here is a height so you can uh, use here a so total area of trapezium will be will be the sum of these two triangle so i write here 1 by 2 base multiply height so area of triangle this plus area of this so 1 by 2 a multiply h so area of trapezium is equal to sum of these two triangle finally we can write area of trapezium is equal to if you take common 1 by 2 and h from this so 1 by 2 h then remaining will be a plus b h so how uh, you find the area of trapezium area of trapezium is equal to 1 by 2 height this shape is trapezium height is given and h h represent the height height is given a plus b a plus b the length of parallel sides this length and this length but how you derive the formula i tell you in the uh, in uh, next video i will solve some example from these and take in other shape and try to solve this if you uh, any question you want to ask me any question you can uh, come in comment box and you inbox me i will reply thank you so much